What is up you guys, this is the White Rabbit, and welcome back to Doom from 2016. Um Hello, I am Vega. Hello. Sentient intelligence assigned to Mars. After running diagnostics on the prayer suit, it appears that I can activate optional challenges that when completed will assist in upgrading your arsenal at an accelerated pace. I have added a tracking component to your dossier. Cool. Don't know what that is, but anyway, before we even get too far into this episode, no, I do not have any idea what the heck I've done with my face paint. So, this is the only face paint I will not be posting anywhere else. Uh, besides on this video. Now, I was eager to get back to this game because I had recently seen, um, what the heck was the name of the movie? Doom Annihilation, which, granted, is not a groundbreaking movie by any standard, but it's still an amazing film. And in the film, it has nothing to do with the Doom guy. Um, so the guy we're playing as has nothing to do with him. It has to do with the events leading up to this the events leading up to what we presume is the first Doom from 1993. Uh, it has to do with where this all began. What started all this? And that's an amazing thing for a movie that came out in 2019 to try to explain Right, before I was so rudely interrupted. Uh, it's amazing for a movie that came out in 2019 to go and try to give a prologue or a pre-sequel to a famous game such as Doom. And they do it well. Oh lord, she's talking again. <clears throat> but they do it well and if it is exactly how it happened then a lot of people have a lot of explaining to do because good grief okay that's the way I came because good grief there's a lot of things they could have done to prevent all this and if you have seen the film you know what I'm talking about if you haven't Go see it, you will figure out what I'm talking about. Um, but yeah, all this, believe it or not, could have been uh, avoided if they had just listened. Creepy sounds. Um, hi. You little... Come here. It's amazing how people only really understand things after it all starts. Like, people only understand the character I'm talking about in the film after all this starts happening. Really? Take that. Now I can get this. Oh. Come on. But I, I'm i honestly liking this game more than the first time I tried to play it back in 2016. And that's, that's something. Because I'm not one to usually come back to a game and then stick with it. Uh... As is, sadly, 
well known for my Subnautica, or not Subnautica, for my Prey uh, try-through, try is what I'm calling it. Because uh, I never really finished the game, so I call it a try-through. Uh, along with... What was the other game? Resident Evil 2. <laughs> the remake, anyway. Um, so I am going to go back to Resident Evil 2, because Resident Evil 3 uh, came out not too long ago. And I kind of want to connect the two stories. Mainly because it kind of connects, anyway. Plus, I want to end up playing... I'm, I'm skipping 4. I'm going to say that now. Because I did try to record 4 in my own time, and I could not do it. <laughs> it was... It was, a. Uh, it was too... What's the word? Um... It was too... Clunky. Let's say that. It was too clunky for my liking. And... You know, if... If I can't get past the first dang level, then we're going to have a problem. Just like me and these guys are going to have a problem in a second. Alright, hold still. Beautiful. Take that, you overgrown oaf. Come here. <laughs> Hold still. There we go. All right. Got a chainsaw. Now where do I go? Zombie? Access Noted. Access has been denied. So, I don't know, ever since I saw Doom Annihilation and I started playing this game, I've been not obsessed, but I've been interested in game movie adaptations, so games that have been made into movies. So what I've done is to prepare for the Resident Evil series, I've been watching Resident Evil movies. So I've gone through Resident Evil 1 through Extinction. And now I just need to watch the rest of them. Hello. Oh, there's a lot of you. Right. If you could all just line up, I have a limited number of bullets. Perfect. Um... Alrighty, I can't get through there. Oh, shut up. I know access is denied. So I do have to go through this door. Don't let there be. Okay. Kind of went against what I was going to say, but not really. Uh, I was going to say don't let there be a demon on the other side, but, you know, it's kind of a crappy demon. So... Not really on my hate list, but, you know, still annoying. Oh boy. Come on. Come on. Give me a challenge. You big guys are not challenging. And it's so weird to see um, to see these guys in the 2016 variation whenever we were fighting them in the 1993 version. Now, the difference... Oh, Doom 1993 was another one of my try-throughs. But I do plan to finish this one. Um, 
And technically, this is another one of my try-throughs, because I only got to the second level, and I never came back to it. <laughs> but this is the second level, and so I'm hoping to beat my own nonsense and get to the third level. But anyway, it's, it's weird to see these guys from their 1993 variation to this new one. Mainly because they look so different. And that's not necessarily a bad thing, it's just... It's odd to see one thing for so long and then see it in a different way. Um, right, where am I going? Oh, hello. Elevator. Are you serious? The Doom guy is going to use an elevator? I mean, alright, if that's what we need to do, but, you know, it seems kind of counterproductive. The Doom guy using an elevator. Where's the crappy music? Oh, joy. Um, health. Another upgrade. So I only have one thing to upgrade, which is the charge shot. Um, sure. And it's kind of sad I can't upgrade my pistol. Because I want to upgrade that. Is it... <laughs> the pistol just seems so counterproductive now. Okay, so I can swap back. Cool. Okay, give me the yellow key card. Thank you. How dare you? <laughs> that startled me for a second. Um All right, so open this. Let's see what this charge shot does. Jeez. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> You want to throw fire at me? I charge shot you. And I like that they disintegrate like uh, the vampires whenever Blade kills them. Are you serious? I used the upgrade thing before I got the dang machine gun. Right, right, right. Come on. What do I have to do? Was oh, there was something else in here. Let's do this. All right, next. Oh, great. Are you... You serious? This gun is amazing. <laughs> Aw. <laughs> it's too amazing. It's too powerful. <laughs> oh, my. But the shotgun... The shotgun just has this, has this thing that I like more. But Zerk mode, I like it. I punched a hole through his chest. Okay, dudes, I'm, I'm just gonna say this is a horrible time to be attacking. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Rip and tear. <laughs> I mean, that's... Oh, oh, dang it, it ran out. Um, where else? Yep, 
If you can hold still. You're... Well, he got away. How dare you. There we go. Ooh, rip. How do I... Oh. Well, that's simple. Armor, you say? Tiger grenade. Okay, that did more than I wanted it to, but it works. Um... Alrighty. Oh! <laughs> now that's nice. That, that, that's, that's what I like to see. That's nice. Um... Where, oh where? Elevator. Elevator. That's where I need to go. Elevator. A breaker! Um, thingy. You. <laughs> I need you. Hand. Technically, I just need his hand, but, you know, it's kind of attached. And that poses a whole lot of problems. I'm blocking your access to the facility scanner. Come to the Vega terminal, and I'll give you what you need. What I need? Okay. Makes no sense, but I'm doing it. Nope. <laughs> you, you gotta... Alright, you gotta admire their perseverance to try and get the Doom Slayer. But at the same time, they're kind of dumb. <laughs> That's just the long and short of it. They're 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 pretty dumb. Excuse me. Hello. Yeah, have a grenade. Yeah. Not exactly your best idea, dude. Hmm. Nope. <laughs> oh, this might be a bit more difficult. Could you hold still for two minutes? Perfect. What else is here? Oh, darn thing. Don't come charging at me like that. Who do? How dare you? That's what you get. Oh, this isn't good. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> you, you scared me there, friend. But I got you. Order one. Jump. Excuse me. Oh. Don't startle me like that. Okay, another suit upgrade. Um. What's in here? Oh, ammo. Um. Was there any point to me coming up here? No. Besides me getting the suit point. Um, I don't think there was a point to me going up there. Hi, how you doing? Yeah. You know, you'd expect them to make more difficult things. Kind of like they do in Resident Evil. Not two things are the same. 
There's nothing up here. There, there's literally nothing up here. Oh. Alright. What is so important that I need in here, sir? It's a gift. Oh. I need to get around. Take it. It will give you strength. Okay, Help but you on your journey. But if you can withstand the power surge. Okay, but what is it? <laughs> I'll take it, but what is it? Ew! Um... I'm gonna go with health. <laughs> Just because I need more health. Hello. No, no it doesn't. Right, Hayden, your progress? Kind of slowing me down here. So. Let's get to it, I guess. Oh, now I can open this door. Uh, hey. Alrighty. So that was the end of that level. Um, continue, I guess, to see what we have to enjoy in the next episode Ugh. lovely map so Dr. Hayden gave us some sort of crushable thing that's going to make us more powerful that gave me more health we've got a pistol, a shotgun and a machine gun and we have Vega I don't see how we can fail. <laughs> Not really, I don't see how we can win. But, beyond that... Okay, and we're just putting it there. So, I'm gonna leave this one here. So, thank you guys so much for watching this one. If you liked it, you know what to do. Keep things crazy, and I'll see you guys. in the next one.